Real quick, if you guys do want to come check out Redemption, the link will be down below. Upon arrival though, guys, make sure to type Colo Colo and Ref. It'll open up a chat like that. Click on YouTuber. And then type my name, Eggy, just like that for a huge starter pack. Redemption is loads of fun and peaks at well over 400 players online. Link down below. And of course, guys, real quick before the video, once again, Redemption sponsored another video channel and hooked you guys up with a huge giveaway. So today, guys, two winner giveaway. Each gonna walk away with five bill cash and in the Halloween spirit, a bonus 2022 Halloween box. Definitely a fatty, so of course, be sure to enter. And as always, if you guys want a chance to do so, make sure to like the video, comment your redemption at GN down below, and of course, subscribe to the channel. Hope to see you guys in game. Either way, really hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so a crazy update just dropped on Redemption, boys. You're definitely going to want to stay tuned. And I'm going to try and do this as quick as possible, but trust me, the devs went ham on this one. Be sure to show them some love. And right away, over to the forums. As always, link down below if you do want to read this for yourself. But starting off huge, Raksha the Shadow Colossus has been added to Redemption. Introducing our last planned installment of RS3 inspired content before we move back to actual custom content. Raksha looks sick, I've seen a couple friends kill it on RS3 so I'm pretty excited for this honestly. And the fact that it's on redemption now, with the Raxor, Telos, and more, it's pretty sick. There is no requirements whatsoever, a duo and a solo mode. And players with active membership will get a streaking bonus. Each kill you do without landing a rare drop, your next kill will have an enhanced drop rate, getting you higher chance towards that rare drop. Looking sick, and a damage cap of 400k per hit splot with a 4 phase boss fight. Pretty excited for this honestly. And yes, a massive list of mechanics, like kinda, it's gonna take a little bit to learn this, I can't even lie. Of course, stay tuned on a future video and a little bit of a loot from, but for the meantime, the drop table. Up to 100 mil cash, some perfect enchantment zones, chunk of salvage, black diamond box, royal mystery box, kismet box, megalotto boxes. 250 mil, more salvage, ultimate armor boxes, Hespori seeds, Horbler supply, ultra pet boxes, cash crates, shadow essence, spike, and crystal, the new Raksha crossbow limbs, stock, and mechanism, the ice, shadow, blood, holy electric, dyes, and the broken shackle. So yes, a ton of brand new items indeed. Chunks of salvage can be used at the salvage table, giving you 100 salvage fragment per chunk. Shadow Essence, materials used to upgrade Shadow Drake, Pristine Eye Gloves and Boots. Shadow Crystal, create the Raksha Crossbow or upgrade to Pristine Eye Glove and Boots. Shadow Spike, used to upgrade the Shadow Drake, Raksha Crossbow Limbs, used to create Crossbow. Same with the Mechanism and the Stock. All the dyes, you can dye it 6 different colors. And the Broken Shackle is the Pet. With 1 in 5 chance for double damage, 50% tribird boost, drop rate and luck, prayer restore, soul slit, and 10% of the player's hit splat as an additional hit. So kinda fat drops. How do you make the crossbow of course? 4 requirements, 75% chance, pretty simple. Some fatty stats. And the dyes on them honestly look insane. Icy, shadow my personal favorite, electric not bad, holy, pretty nice, and as well too. With the draconic forge we can now upgrade our shadow drake. Needing the Essence and the Spike and the Drake, 75% chance, which now, 1 in 5 chance to deal 3 times damage, 50% Tribrid Boost, 50 Drop Rate, 50 Luck, Prey Restore, Soul Split, deals 60% of the owner's damage as an additional hit. Fat as fuck. Again as well, Pristine Gloves and Boots, I, pretty simple, better stats. And as well, a new set bonus when equipping both Pristine Boots and Gloves, I, 1 in 10 chance to do double hit, 1 in 10 chance to do 3 times damage, and a 30% Tribrid bonus. So I mean, Raksha just extended a redemption so much. This is gonna be crazy. I will be doing a ton of content on Raksha. Be sure to stay tuned. But next up, the baby quest line. I I don't I don't know why. Honestly, I have no idea why. Don't look at me. Don't comment. Don't give me the hate. Uh, anyways, really, this is a question I ask myself sometimes. The new simple quest is just an errand task to run around redemption, kill various NPCs. Three steps. The baby's at the home area, speak to him to get started, and you get yourself two weeks free of elite membership. Kinda cool. Also, this is massive. The first RSPS with proximity voice chat. AoE voice chat on an RSPS, yes. Welcome to COD Lobby Cancer. It's gonna be pretty cool, actually. As well, new season's pass improvements. Looking a lot better, easy to run through. With a huge task system list. But onto the Halloween event. Yes, it is pretty much Halloween. A new Halloween quest. 
Father Eric needs help gathering supplies to help cure a demonic possession after a man accidentally sold his soul to the devil in order to save his wife. Interesting is a pretty simple quest. As always, link down below if you want to read this for yourself, or of course, stay tuned to the video. And if you guys remember, it is the exact same as last year. Ghost Rider, get yourself the Headless Head, and now the ability to farm the Ghost Rider for a pretty spicy drop table too. And of course, with Halloween keys comes the Halloween chest. Baddie drop table, a bunch of Halloween candy, a bunch of cash. Warlock set, pumpkin lantern, grave digger set, ghost face set, hunting knife, spider cape, flying pumpkin pet, Halloween cape, bow of arachnia, Halloween boots, grim reaper hood, Halloween hat, chucky pet, Halloween icon, scythe, chainsaw, jack set, wolf set, spooky spider set, spooky spider pet, eek pet, ghostly, Georgie pet, Pennywise mask, the bow again, pumpkin decimators, which I kinda want really bad, I'm sad I didn't get it last year. Either way, Ghostly has Shadow Pet stats, Georgie has Baby Yoda, Flying Pumpkin has Thanos, Spider Cape is cosmetic, looks pretty sick, the Ghost Face set, Halloween Cape, Grave Digger, Warlock, the Bow, the Pumpkin Desis, look at those, bro, they look insane, I need to get them. And as well, boys, the Haunted House minigame has returned. Pretty simple, kill five bosses, Scream, Dracula, Frankenstein, Michael Myers, Grim Reaper, Pennywise, finish it, get chances at goodies, and all the sets. Ghostface, Pennywise, Georgie, Michael Myers, Grim Reaper, the lot of it. Dude, with Halloween on Redemption, bro, so many items come back into the game, it is so sweet. Halloween Global Boss as well, the Jacko Kraken spawns every 2,500 Halloween candy. Not bad. And again, another fatty drop table. As well, brand new Halloween 2022 boxes. Yes, stay tuned, gonna be doing an opening here too. First off though, Halloween Crossbow, 30k stats, 25k range strength, not bad. Venom set, this looks cool as fuck. The Middle Finger Scepter, I mean, I kinda have to have this. Scythe the Pumpkin looks crazy. The Spooky Raven, I like it. Identical to Shadow Drake, by the way. So, stay tuned, gonna be opening up quite a few of those. Still not done, by the way, prestigious star boxes. Another brand new box, sick of wasting your efforts trying to get a top reward from stars or superstars, prestiges are now here. And you will get yourself a guaranteed drop from the list here. What? There's a purple AFK icon? I kinda need that, I had no idea. Anyways, not bad. As always though, list of bug fixes, changes, and all the custom donos, link down below if you wanna read this for yourself. I wanna point out, with breeding the mechanics, and trying it for a good 25 minutes, I still have yet to get an actual Raksha kill. This is hard and definitely gonna be a challenge. Like I said, stay tuned on a future video. Raksha is a crazy update for the server. Oh, as well, something I do maybe kinda wanna spoil, I might get in trouble for it, but mobile is dropping very soon. Stay tuned, and of course, link down below. But honestly, I am mad impressed with this update, with voice chat, with Raksha, the huge Halloween expansion, and all of the small shit in between, bro, this has been a fatty. Make sure when you're online, give the devs a huge round of applause. Either way though guys, super quick video today. Like I said, a brief little update showcase on Redemption. And yes, stay tuned, I am gonna be dropping a ton of future content. I've got a series already started, and as well, we're gonna be pumping out the streams again. Stay tuned, boys. Either way, link down below, make sure to pop on Redemption. And of course, guys, make sure to enter for that huge giveaway. And as always, to join mining the Redemption Discords by using the links down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and later!